Without further ado, Senator Edwards. Our dependence on oil in America is a significant contributor not only to global warming, but also to the insecurity that we face. There is a direct link between our addiction to oil and our national security. Uh, we are forced to rely on hostile in some cases and unstable countries in other cases in order to have the energy supply that we depend on economically. Today, more than ever, energy technology can actually be not only not a hindrance to the American economy, energy technology can be the fuel, the engine of the American economy. And I think the starting place is exactly what's being done here, which is to, to fall back on and advance America's creativity and ingenuity and innovation. Because that is, in fact, that spirit, that innovation, that entrepreneurial innovation is what fueled the digital revolution here in America and for that matter around the world. And now we have a chance to blaze the same kind of trail with an energy revolution. We can revitalize rural America by investing in new forms of energy, including a lot of the work that's being done right here. And we can help American businesses stay competitive and lead the world in the use of this new technology. We should be creating this new technology, not waiting for someone else to do it. Our generation has got to be the one that says yes to alternative renewable fuels and ends our dependence on foreign oil forever. This is one of the great challenges of our lifetimes. It is time for all of us to prove that we are patriotic and that we're willing to be patriotic about things other than war, that we're willing to do the things for this country that we love so much that will make her stronger and better and make America stronger and better. Will we lead the world in this great new challenge? Will we blaze the trail? Will we be the bold, courageous innovators that America has been so often in the past? I think the answer is yes. The answer is yes, America has led before and we can do it again. Bless you all, thank you for coming. <laughs>